This is madness, Sophie. The peacekeepers have more weapons. Men. They will crush us like worms. Ator may have more men, but we have the home field advantage. Home field advantage? You're crazy. I forbid it. While I lead the bazaar, no one will attack the peacekeepers. You no longer lead the bazaar. What? You're no leader, Carl. Never were. We lost people because of you. Crystals. You almost got yourself killed. My mother wanted a free bazaar, not slaves serving the peacekeepers. I want to restore peace here. You can help me with this, or leave. Roger, Humphrey, arrest them. What are you doing? They want to betray the bazaar. Roger! You have no power anymore, Carl. You want to be like your mother? You'll have blood on your hands, Sophie. A lot of blood. Carl is right. We don't stand a chance in open battle. Sophie? What the... Therefore, we're gonna weaken them first. What do you mean? We'll cut off their main source of electricity. Without UV lamps, Ador can't defend his base. They will be driven from the metro tunnels and cut off from the armory. How does all this get me to the central loop? Once Ador is weakened, he will retreat for reinforcements. Then you can make it to the central loop, Aiden. But first, we have to blow up the windmill. And fast, before Ador gets wind of what we're planning. Barney, gather our people. Be ready. Roger and Humphrey, go to the armory, provide weapons to anyone capable of fighting. And you, Aiden, go to Alberto and Vincenzo. They'll walk you through the plan. Okay. Community and freedom, Aiden. Together, we will win. This new armor of yours is flimsy. More fit for a beetle than people. Yeah, way too thin. Fierstein! Beetle shells are great protection! This is top craftsmanship made from the finest quality materials. Built from. Ah! Ah! Uh oh, I can almost see the steam pouring from his ears. Look out! <laughs> He's gonna blow! <laughs> titanium. We reinforce the armor with titanium we pulled from the scrapyard. That's why they're lighter, and better protection. You guys shouldn't be such dicks. Well, why didn't he just say so? We'll see. Thanks, Vincenzo. You didn't have to. It was nothing, Dad. Ah. As for you, those two oafs took the last titanium vests! No, I'm not here for armor. Sophie sent me. You're supposed to bring me in on some plan? The plan? My plan? Call agreed? Call agreed! You hear that, Vincenzo? Not Carl. Sophie. You gonna share or do I have to guess? Windmill. We take down the windmill. Bingo! The big windmill that provides power to the PK headquarters. <laughs> but first, we need the charges that Jack and Joe left at the water tower. Hmm? Would you bring them to us, Pilgrim? After we blow it up, all the UV lamps in the PK headquarters will go out. That'll allow the infected to attack them. Hmm? Old Villador will be free again. And you, you have a clear route to, uh, uh, you know, the past chemical fallout and to... Uh, uh, What's it called? The Central Loop. The Central Loop! Right! How do you know the PK will withdraw and not retaliate? Because Dad designed this windmill. He knows it like the back of his hand. And it's the PK base's only power source. Without it, the PKs won't last another night in Old Villador. But we must act fast before the peacekeepers catch wind of our plans. So... You win? Okay, so 
The windmill powers all the PK's UV lamps? Yes, it does indeed. A lot of people will die. Only if the PK don't turn tail and head back to where they belong. They stole that windmill from us. It was ours. Lucas and his men, they... When they came, they... Ah! Ah! Damn it! Took, took it. it. Exactly. They took it. Without electricity, Ator can't keep anyone here. We have generators, smaller power sources. They need a large power source. They'll have to withdraw. And before they return with backup from the central loop, we'll block the tunnel ourselves. Their commander, Jack Matt, is not going to risk fighting in the dark with the infected and renegades at his back. Old Villador will be ours again, and you will go to the center. Right, fine, I'll do it. Okay, go to the water tower. We're going to use the charges that Jack and Joel tried to blow it up with. Let me know once you get there. PKs. They've been searching us for weapons. Found our Molotovs and went apeshit, slaughtering everyone in sight. Looks like someone set us up. Who? And where are the bombs for Alberto? We managed to send some out. The couriers last reported near Star Square. Then silence. Alberto, the charges are gone. I'm going to the Star Square. That was their last check-in. Exactly. Ada? Yeah. Be careful. Someone sold us out. Find the, the, the charges. Without them, the plan cannot proceed. Doing what I can. I'll be in touch. PK's ambushed your transport. He searched everyone and everything. Eventually they found the bomb. Someone tipped them off. And they took everything? Dunno. Suddenly something scared them off. And what? Where are the charges? Hey! Um, they were in the yard. Come on, maybe they didn't steal all of them. Lucky few of the infected showed up. Everyone scattered, probably leaving the bombs behind. Don't know why they didn't steal them. They were right under their noses. Morons. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> 
Alberto, I have the charges. Wonderful! Excellent! So what are you waiting for? Come back! Here I come. Where's your father? There you are! Only two? The PKs took the rest. Damn, damn it, triple damn! Because of that traitor, our plan is in danger! We must act quickly! No, nitrates. We need fertilizer. Then we can make more explosives. The old night runners, they've got everything. And certainly all we'll need to make more bombs. I know a guy. Lives on a rooftop. Friend, a foe. It depends. Killian. You know him? But Hakon's friend, Killian? Yes, Killian. I'll explain how to... How to... Uh, uh, I know the way. Thanks. Still here. Are you crazy? Get to Killian! Fuck me, people will always complain. Killian! Killian! It's Aiden! There? Killian!
there's Hakon. Back then, everyone must... Bingo. Alberto, I have your fertilizer. It's Vincenzo. Vincenzo? I, I can barely hear you. The PKs, they raided my place. I can't talk. The traitor, he sold us all out. Hayden, Dad, went ahead to the windmill. Meet him there. I'll meet you when I can. Just make sure that fertilizer gets to my dad. Okay, I'll do my best. Just come quick. They're still after me. I'm pinned down. Hayden, another patrol. You have to do it without me. Join my dad. I'll be on the radio the whole time. Me and your dad? You think that's a good idea? We have no choice, Aiden. Hurry. Please. Oof. This plan means everything to my dad. I don't know if you noticed, but dad's kind of awkward and unappreciated. This is a chance to show Carl, Sophie, everyone at the bazaar that they were wrong. What dad's made of, what he can do. He'll be the hero of the bazaar after this one. He always wanted to do something big. That's exactly what I'm afraid of. I'll stay with you on the radio. Hello? Vincenzo? Hello? Vincenzo, I... I can't hear you. What? What do I have to do? Fertilizer. You sure you got this? Of course I'm sure. And if I don't know something, I can ask Vincenzo. Ah, the windmill's causing too much interference. The radio doesn't work. Ah. Then I'll figure it out myself. It's as easy as I. And you're certain? He explained everything to me. Relax. We'll do... Me and you will do... <laughs> no reason we won't do just... And... Fine. Like I said, easy as pie. The bombs are ready. You're up. Take the charges and secure them to the spots Vincenzo marked for us. Planting bombs. Oh, what could go wrong? Easy as pie, right? Yes, precisely. Like I said, easy as pie. Bombs are ready. <sighs> you didn't see Jack shit.
Explosives are in place. Time for the fireworks. Would you like the honors? I know how much this means to you. That isn't triggering. Must be interference from the wind. Uh, it doesn't look like it did much. The windmill's still standing. Hey, look, the rotor's still spinning. Vincenzo's calculations. They must be off. Have it fixed in a flash. Gotta see this through. It's my fault, not Vincenzo's. My fault. What are you doing? An armed bomb? Before the PKs get here. Giving you an armed... Um, ah, armed... Ah. We can't rely on radio detonation. Not with all the interference. What now? This one is guaranteed to blow up the whole windmill. All right, how much time do I have? Let me count. Hmm? It'll blow any second. Run! But where am I supposed to put it? Where? You have to go back! And? And plant it on... Uh, place it on... Put it on... The... Plant it... Plant it where? On the generator? No! Not there! And leave it by the base of the windmill? No! That will accomplish nothing! On the rota! You have to climb up to the rota! To the very top? You serious? The bomb's ticking, Ada. You really think we have time for jokes?
Hello? Hey, Alberto? I'm coming! You sons of bitches! What have you done to him? still be standing. Almost like the fireworks in 90... Uh, 90... Uh, even... Ah, oh, man. I'm old. And you'll just keep getting older. Quit the bullshit, Aiden. I'm not that adult. Thanks for helping me. <laughs> I know what they think of me. Of course I know. <laughs> Tell everyone we pulled this off thanks to Vincenzo. Okay. <laughs> That's thanks to you, Alberto. No. Thanks to Vincenzo, okay? They laugh at him. Laugh because of me. <laughs> but now that we've done this, they won't laugh anymore. See, he's, he's old man's, huh? Not a cook or a, or a failure anymore. Force the peacekeepers to withdraw. Say it was him. Promise me. All right. Okay. Oh, and tell him. Tell him that... That's okay. I'll tell him. That I'm proud. Never told him that. Son, I'm proud of you. I'll tell him for you. I promise. you put on. Now it's time to blow this popsicle stand. I can't. One thing I still have to take care of. You don't get it. There's no time to waste. We can make our way to the center now. Everyone's too busy to notice. I promised Alberto I'd tell his son something for him. Do you want to finish your business or play shepherd spreading the good word? Well, it's bad news, Hakan. Alberto is dead. I see. But the metro is empty. There might never be another chance like this. Are you sure? I have to go find Vincenzo, Hakon. I promised. 
A night fucking errant. Hurry! Remember Sarah and Yana. Find me at their place when you're done. If you're still alive. So it was Carl who betrayed them. I know chess. And what's happening between Renegade... I'd call that a wrap. All cleaned up. Didn't put up much of a fight. Yeah, because they're cowards. Told you before. What about the prisoners? Throw them in the dungeon? Unless you feel like banging them first. Look. It's Chubbs. They killed Chubbs? Looks like it. But only him, I think. We gotta tell Anderson. Yeah, but where is she? Should have been here ages ago. I'll look for her. Catch <laughs> <laughs> over, man. I can't believe Carl betrayed us. Fuck, Pilgrim. At first I thought you gave us up. But Carl... If it wasn't for him, the Peacekeepers wouldn't have attacked. But he fled right after the blast. There are more on the upper level. Okay, I'll go there. You run. We got See orders it. yet. I need back. Chew on this. Five straight days of patrolling. I'm exhausted. Hey. Aiden? Yeah, don't be scared. It's safe now. <sighs> Thank you. Hey, Sophie. So where's Vincenzo? Aiden, watch out! <laughs> Aiden's gonna pay me hella gold for you! Good! Shit! <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Guy wasn't even worth a golden shower. Get up, Aiden. Thanks, man. That makes us even. It's not over yet. Aiden! Aiden! Come on, oh. coward! Come down and fight! You better get out of here, Anderson. You're on bizarre turf. Look, tell Aiden there's still time to call this off. Why would he do that? We're winning! You're stupider than I thought. Come down and fight, and stop using your bizarre buddies as human shields. Aiden, no! Aiden, we have reports that Aider's men are retreating. The plan worked. We took out their lights, and the infected tore them to pieces. They don't stand a chance without them. Ader withdrew his men. They're in the metro tunnels. We're not getting to the center that way. Carl betrayed us. He's the one who went to the peacekeepers and warned them. Claimed he wanted to prevent bloodshed, but made things worse. But now, I run the bazaar. And I promise, we will defeat Ador. And I will take you to the central loop. Sophie runs the bazaar! 
for Sophie! <laughs> you know how many PK creeps it takes to screw in a light bulb? None, because they're too dead to screw anything. <laughs> Alberto's dead. <laughs> Don't be a buzzkill, Aiden. Yeah. <laughs> I'm serious. He was killed taking down the windmill. How'd it happen? We put Vincenzo's plan into motion, but then... Alberto had to go in his son's place. Sacrificed himself to blow up the windmill. Fuck me. To Alberto! To Alberto! <laughs> so... Where's Vincenzo? He's outside. Look around. Vincenzo. <laughs> we did it, Aiden. My dad, he really did it. Your father wanted me to tell you, um, he's always been proud of you. Very proud. What? Why are you telling me this and not him? He died, Vincenzo. Died for the bazaar. Was he in pain when he died? No, he was all smiles. Because of you. And because he was able to carry out your plan. Thanks for being there with him, Aiden. Your dad kicked ass, Vincenzo. Yeah, Alberto's all right. Hell of a craftsman. For a loser, you mean. For a failure. That's what you used to say. If only we had more like Alberto, the PKs would have been gone ages ago. You... Go in and check on Vincenzo. Now! You did a freaking awesome job, Aiden. We'll beat the PK and we'll help you get to the center. You're one of us now, brother. You're part of the Bizarre family. Thanks, Barney. Good luck. Good luck, Pilgrim. Hey, Akon. Where are you? I'm waiting for you at the girl's place. You'd better hurry, Aiden. The passage to the center, it's blocked. I have another idea. Just come quickly. Time is not on our side. Okay, I'm coming. Hakon. Ah, you're finally here. Let's go. When Yana heard you were coming, she grabbed Sarah and they left. Seems they weren't too fond of you. And where are we at? Ah, well, it's fucking hell. Ah. Calm down, just let me see. Let me see, I'll ah, help. fuck! Wait! I'll help, ah. show me. Relax, you're gonna pull through. What's that? The wound from the Lazarus? You say you killed Lucas. If not for those brass knuckles, it would only took a few seconds to do the job. Ah, I thought he was a better fighter. Ah! The fuck are you saying? Ah, no point denying it with this wound, right? So you carved ah. out his tattoo and planted it on Barney. Ah, Waltz. He ordered the kill. You're working with Waltz and you didn't tell me? You piece of shit. Oh, you don't get it, kid. Waltz would have killed me, you see, like he killed Dylan. And anyone who defies him. I have to get out of here, get it? I couldn't have told you. Why? You know he's the one who tortured me in the past. I didn't tell you in order to protect you. So what if you find out something about your sister? Waltz will kill you. Where is he? Ah, fuck. Where is Waltz? Supposed to meet him under the electric car factory in the GRE tunnel. 
Hey, then I'm fucking dead here, understand? They're gonna kill me. You'd leave me. You'd leave me now. You'll get what you deserve. And whoever's after you can finish what they started. Either the assassin will get you, or the infected will. You'll never find your sister. Waltz is going to kill you. <sighs> nice knowing you, Aiden. Fuck you. Sophie, I'm gonna need your help getting to the center. The guy who was supposed to get me there, he... Well, things got complicated. Aider's men are still fighting. They barricaded themselves inside the tunnel. I can't help you. What about our agreement? Relax. Listen, there's another way through. An old tunnel under the hills near the Tango Motel. It was used by smugglers. Peacekeepers didn't even know about it. It's been closed for years. But if you manage to start the generators, you might be able to get to the center. And you're telling me this just now. Sorry, Aiden. I want to help you. But most of all, I had to help the bazaar. Good luck, Pilgrim. <laughs>